Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Janet De Luna. Welcome back. In today's video, I'm going to talk about the original line. We're going to be trying Vienna Linesio Lungo. I hope you are doing amazing. My last video is a little bit all over the place and it was actually harder than I thought. So I'm thinking of maybe just sticking to coffee related videos just for now until <laughs> until a little bit later. But but all right. So today's video we are going to talk about this capsule and let's see. Vienna Linesio Lungo is a round and smooth coffee capsule. It's a 3.7 ounce Lungo, 6 out of 13 of intensity. It's 70 cents a capsule, so it goes for $7 a sleeve. The roastiness is 3 out of 5, acidity is 1 out of 5, bitterness is 2 out of 5, and body is 2 out of 5. This one is a light, medium roasted coffee. Aromatic profile, round and smooth, aromatic notes, malty, cereal, sweet. And they say, top up your Lungo cup with hot water. For a 5.7 ounce cup, and pair it with a slice of cake. That's what they say to do. And a little background on this capsule or where it comes from. This Lungo is made of Brazil's pulped natural processed bourbon beans with washed Colombian Arabica, which gives the smooth and balanced taste. Let's see. My cousin says this one's her favorite, so I am very excited to try it. And I love that, the colors. So pretty. Um, let's see. This is what the capsule looks like. Beautiful orange, and at the back it has its name, Vienna Lungo. Beautiful. we are back we have our brewed coffees so we have it black right here we have some eyes we have i have my setup right here and i'm ready to make it iced and try it hot so let's see let's try it black first i've noticed that i really love the lungos in the original machine they just they taste so good Ooh, that's hot. Okay. I like that. I really like that. This reminds me of... It's going to be weird, but... This reminds me of caramel cookie without the caramel. It's... I feel like it, uh, it might be a little bit weird, but... It tastes like caramel cookie without the caramel. And I love caramel cookie really hot mmm yeah that's good and want to try it with just a little bit of milk before I add creamer because I want to see how the milk because sometimes when you add milk I feel like or at least me I can taste other things like the Costa Rica when I added milk I can taste the cereal and it is amazing I love how that happens so I'm just gonna go ahead and add a little bit of just oat milk. This is what it looks like. Hmm. It's good, but I really liked that I feel like it just kind of not water it down because it's not water but I feel like the coffee flavor just kind of mild down a lot 
So I actually like this one black rather than milk. Yeah, let's see. Roastiness, three out of five. Acidity, bitterness. Yeah, the milk kind of just milded it down a lot. And I don't really like that. Let's put a little bit of creamer. Mm, it tastes so good with that creamer. And then the little foam at the top. Mm-hmm. Next time I make it, I'm not gonna add any milk. I'm just gonna add a little bit of creamer and I feel like that would be perfect. Mm-hmm. Oh, you know what? I actually have a little bit of coffee here. So I'm gonna add it and see. Mm, yep. Mm -hmm. oh, it's so good. So with this one, I, I appreciate the strong coffee flavor of it. I love it. We are going to try it cold. You know, since the milk really mild it down, I'm just going to use creamer. And we'll see how we like it like that. I'm going to try and do this on camera without spilling. Oh, yep, I spilled. <laughs> How's everyone doing? I feel like I haven't talked to you guys in forever. Please talk to me in the comments. Let me know how y'all are doing. What are y'all's summer plans? Have y'all been going out? This is what it looks like. Beautiful color. It's very mild and I didn't add milk I added creamer I know this is gonna sound crazy but I'm gonna add more creamer um, and see the sweetness of I'm using this creamer you know I not really like this creamer until right now that I made it with that one really good Oh, that's good that's better but you know what I feel like I would need two capsules if I want to make it iced because the taste really milds down whenever you add milk or creamer so two shots would work great but I know that if I added another one it would be amazing I really like this one one out of five I give it a five I love it I like it black and any coffee that I like black, I give it a five because it is good. From what Nespresso is saying about this pot, let me tell you what I taste, okay? Let me grab my notes. Let's see. Oh, yes. Smooth and balanced. You can taste that when you try it black. Really, really good smooth and balanced. Yes. Multi cereal. Yes. Sweet. Yes. And that's all my favorite. I really love cereal. I really love malty, sweet, smooth, balanced. It doesn't really have a bitterness, 2 out of 5, and acidity, 1 out of 5. But you know what? Sometimes I feel like I have liked the acidity. But roastiness, 3 out of 5. Every, I feel like, to me, because I know that everyone's taste buds are different, but to me, everything they are saying, I feel like it's yes, 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 yes. 6 out of 13 for intensity. Yeah, uh, maybe. I feel like maybe it's not too strong since whenever you put milk, it kind of milds it down. But when it's black, mm, yeah, like five, five or six. And light, medium, roasted. 
yeah this capsule is right on i definitely recommend it if you have an original line and you are looking for new capsules try this one put it in your list you will not regret it oh, i hope you like it i feel like even if like i don't like certain ones i know that you know we all like different things so it's nice to try different things mm, that's so good <laughs> I do recommend that if you do it iced and you like stronger coffees, maybe just put or put two capsules instead of one. If you're the type of person that you like your creamer with a splash of coffee, uh, just stick to one. If you like the strong taste of coffee, put two. That's good. Adding the creamer makes it sweeter. And I just love it. I actually really like it, like iced. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it actually doesn't need two for me. Mm -hmm. You guys, thank you, Yesenia, to my beautiful cousin who recommended this pod. It's so good. Well, you guys, that's going to be the end of my video. Thank you so much for watching and tuning in. Y'all stay safe out there. If y'all have any recommendations, if y'all want me to try any certain pods, just let me know. Talk to me, guys. Talk to me in the comments. I love talking to y'all. And I feel like I haven't talked to y'all in a long time. Tag me on your coffee recipes on Instagram, and I'll put them at the end of my videos. Bye! Bye!